The house at 409 Wabash Avenue was built in 1894 for August Rosenberger. Rosenberger was born on December 19, 1848, in Germany. In 1859, he, his mother, and his siblings joined his father in Evansville, Indiana. As an adult, he partnered with his brother-in-law, Anthony J. Klein, to run Rosenberger, Klein & Company Mercantile on Franklin Street, which is today the Gerst House. They later phased out of the mercantile and into the broom industry with Southwest Broom Manufacturing Company on 9th Avenue, the current home of Plumber Supply Company. For years, August Rosenberger was an active member of the community. He was a president of the Westside Bank Loan and Savings Association and a member of the Knights of Columbus and St. Boniface Catholic Church, which was across the street from his house. When the church caught fire in 1902, he witnessed the lightning strike and was then a major benefactor in the restoration of the building. After Klein's death, Rosenberger moved to Wichita, Kansas and set more of his focus on the broom industry. The house he built remains. The evident Queen Anne style was popular for the time of construction. The brick home is two stories with a pitched gable roof dormer, and double-hung windows with decorative limestone window heads. The left third of the front facade consists of a collection of bays. The first story is a three-part bay. The second story bay is rectangular with the appearance of a balcony with decorative railing and East Lake frieze. The third story is a gable featuring windows and louvers in a round opening. The extended limestone porch was added later in the 1920s to the existing front and side porches. The most prominent feature is the square tower on the front right corner of the home. It is capped by a catenary dome with a finial on the top. The Rosenberger home continues to stand out as one of the most magnificent homes in the Wabash residential neighborhood.